and welcome to the first ever episode of Being Brumo. Hello. The driver's eye view. So this channel is basically, um, I, uh, in the past I was a racer, I raced go-karts and formula cars and it's been a while since I've been out on track. Um, but next year I plan to return and this channel um, was an idea mixed between the motor vlogs of some of my favourites such as Snowcad or Volkswagen, um, Baron Von Grumble. Um, but yeah, basically, uh, POV driving views between the vehicles I drive uh, working for dealerships and uh, the vehicles I may race or take on track or, or test drive. So the idea of, um, of my future in motorsport is to race anything I can. Not do a full season in anything, but just race um, things, test drive things, um, you know, do laps around track, do, uh, you know, just experiences. And, and maybe it'll go into motorcycles as well. Who knows, that's something I'm thinking about in the future. This is the first video. So this is going to be a short one and uh, just basically showing you um, this car. Now I am, um, it is a Snow White 2015 Kia Optima Hybrid. Um, it is brand new, it has at the moment only done 89 kilometers, kilometers being the measurement we use in Canada. Um, so it's, uh, it's pretty new. Uh, it's a, a weird thing if you've ever driven a, um, a hybrid, when you turn the car on you in this case you push a button and then nothing happens it just sort of the dials will move a bit and that's about it yeah it's a nice driving car the handling's pretty good uh, it's got some good power to it obviously with the engines and that it uh, doesn't feel too heavy um, having two sets of motors in it but um, yeah I don't know that's uh, that's all I've got to say really that's the first uh, little video it's just a short one to start off with uh, just to introduce the channel and, um, and get a video up there. But more to come, probably in the not too distant future. Okay, yeah, so I'll uh, speak to you soon. Bye bye. <laughs> Bonus footage. No, he's not even paying attention. As a uh, snowcat would uh, testify to, and uh, he's tried to convince people he doesn't go around looking for trouble. I mean, Calgary looks substantially worse than most Canadian cities that I've experienced. Maybe, um, maybe not Montreal, but I don't know. Um, but you don't go looking for bad drivers in Canada. They they find you, and. Uh, there's a prime example. That's a common occurrence. I mean, checking blind spots. I mean, I think if I'm right, he flashed his indicator once, and I mean, sometimes that's amazing. Sometimes he's actually thought, oh, he's indicated. Whereas a lot of the time, they don't even bother using indicators or signals. They just move. So at least he gave me some sort of notice apart from swerving directly into my view or into my lane, into my, you know, into my space. It was so close on the front. I don't know how the, if the camera picked up how close that was. But this is quite a long um, car, a long hooded car. And um, he went straight in front and he made me break, if that's anything to go by. And people love going over these um, solid lines as well. Absolutely love it.